We begin with building on Christ. We'd be nowhere without the ability to stand in his promises, like we're forgiven, we're gonna rise again, God's got this. And that gives us, not only empowers us to go forward, but gives the confidence, you know, to do so. And it's Jesus that we want to share with others as well. And then impacting lives is giving them Christ, you know, sharing that hope and peace that we get to have in a crazy world. We get to give it to others that need it. I think more than ever. And that's why God has put us here right this time at this place. Our ministry campaign, Building on Christ, Impacting Lives, reflects that we have laid a foundation here at St. James. And by God's grace, we are in a position now to grow our ministries even further to bring hope and peace to the lives of more people in Chicago. We are at a point in time where we have seen a lot of growth at St. James. I reflect and I think back to a time as a church member that there was a possibility of closing the school because of low enrollment and now we are flourishing. And so now is the time to enhance our facilities, enhance our ministries so that we are in a position to bring the good news to anyone who comes through the doors of the church or school. As far as having a state-of-the-art sanctuary, we can communicate better. I want people to hear the good news better, hear the music better, connect with it better with some new screens that'll fit in and just new lighting overall. I think it'll bless the edification of everyone here. We're running out of room. What's amazing is that we have so many families that really want to be here, and we just don't have any space anymore. So for us to be able to put all the kids in the school that want to go to school here, we really need more space. We need more classrooms. We need to fix our bathrooms. And the idea of having more space upstairs for our kids in the gym is just phenomenal. I think it's really important for us to invest in our future. I think it's important for those of us that have so much that we give back. And I think by people investing in this vision and this future, you're really investing in the community and you're investing in our kids. And what better way to help our community than to invest in our kids and give them a place where they feel safe, where they're loved, where they can grow and they can understand exactly who they are. While Building on Christ Impacting Lives clearly references the major construction we have planned, more importantly to me, it references the firm foundation that we have. We're building on years and years of God's graces to our congregation and the hard work of many, many leaders who have been before us. The more people that we can get involved, the better it's going to be. It's going to take a community to build up. We are looking for anybody who can contribute any way they can. Through the history of the church, God has orchestrated people coming together and giving their best. Giving their best financially, giving their best in prayer, giving their best in time and talent. And he has built amazing things through people and that's what's gonna happen here. If you're sitting out there thinking what you can do, one of them is prayerfully think, how can I be financially committed to this? Whether it's a large amount, whether it's a pledge, a commitment of once a month, that's huge, but also prayer. Truly praying that people come to know Christ through this campaign is huge, let alone what are your talents and skills? Where are there needs in this community where you could help out and to serve your neighbor, to serve your brother and sister? Those things God will take, and I really believe we'll be surprised as to how God will bless us through this person's gift, through this person's talent, and how we will make an even larger presence in Chicago known through St. James, that there is hope in this world. Building on Christ, impacting lives. From foundation to future.